Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and this is a quick feature that still exists and there were some times when we had it disappear. Some people were thinking, well, maybe it's gone. Well, nope, it's still there and you can still use it and it's actually a great tool. It looks like the um, feature in Mac computers where you can actually back up your files and it's the uh, file history feature. So when you actually want to back up Windows and your files on your hard drive, there is still this really nice tool in Windows 10. In your settings, you go to Update and Security. On the left side, you will have a backup. Now, when you click here, it says Backup Using File History, which means you can now click Add a Drive. It's going to search for external drives that you might have plugged in. It doesn't work with uh, USB thumb drives. You really need to have a hard drive. And add that drive to the computer. What this does? Well, it's going to start backing up your files. And you can actually set, um, you know, backup every day, every week, and so on. And what's nice, it's not called file history for nothing, is that every time you do, you, you, t you know, use or create a new file or modify or update a document, well, you will have all of these different versions in the file history because when you'll go back, you'll be able to actually use it and have it used by date. So you can say, oh, well, I remember that on March 30th, 30th there was a, a document that I want to have that version. Uh, it's been modified since. Well, you can go back in your file history hard drive with this tool. And, of course, you can... Um, at that time, check out files that were modified or files on a specific date. It keeps a certain amount of time, typically a month, depending on what you have space available, and it will erase at some point some older uh, file history. So basically, if you get your drive that gets quite full, it will start actually deleting the older file histories that you have and replacing them with newer file history backups. So it's an interesting tool. It works well. It's uh, created in a way that it's easy to use because it has the same file structure as your f file explorer has on your hard drive. So you can actually easily go back to backups of a certain date and then get the files that you want. So don't really no need for any um, software of any kind that you add to your PC. Uh, file history actually works really, really well. And I've used it a lot over the last few years and uh, really, really enjoy. One word of caution here, some antivirus, if you're not using the Windows Defender antivirus, some antivirus software sometimes seem to interfere with it. Another software also that seemed to interfere with it from time to time is CCleaner. So if it has problems or you have problems, make sure that maybe you added a new software to your computer and that is blocking the use of file history. So uh, great tool to back up your PC on an hard, external hard drive. Once again, simply go to your settings, go into update and security, go to backup on the left, and you will have file history. All you have to do is plug in the drive on the USB port, then click add a drive. It will search for the drives that are available and let you choose a drive that you can use. If it doesn't show up, your drive is either not formatted properly or is not big enough to be used as a file history backup drive. Uh, and remember that uh, USB thumb drives don't work with file history. You need to have a really an external hard drive. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.